Yeah, yeah, yeah. You already know, man. Yeah. We outside with it. Yeah, that boy. Uh, Wait. The fucking um, Pure Miami 2023. Yes, sir. You know what I'm saying? And they done hired us to take their ass down, so we gonna take them now. Yes, sir. It's the road to rolling loud. 55 days. How much you think we making this rolling loud? You did 20 last year. What's, what's your, uh, what's we your, did what's 20 your, last year. You did 20 last year. What's your, what's your prediction? We, we have, we have, we have Voltron. Voltron. If we, yeah. have, if we have Voltron, 25 plus. You hear me? Right now we got Nip, Mufasa, Pumpkin. and Pumpkin. Those are the only three in the game right now. That's the big three. But by uh, Rolling Loud, we're supposed to have five. Give me the dream team, Voltron. And Voltron consists of the big three plus Alpha. Alpha is the big, 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 big boy. That's the sack. That boy sack. Yeah, so Alpha is an eight seater that we're working on getting on right now. We're supposed to be pulling up to Texas, 17 hour drive to go pick that boy up in about a few weeks. Yeah, 40,000. 40,000 for a golf cart. But it's okay, we're gonna make that back in the day. Assets over liabilities. Yes, Today we got our first contract. With an event called Pure Miami. It's an all white event. They booked all three golf carts for six hours. We charge, I ain't gonna tell you what we charge an hour right now. But if you do the math, six hours, three golf carts each. Yeah, I'm gonna show y'all what the vibe's looking like. We're in our all white right now. I already got mine dirty. I hate wearing all white. I get that shit dirty as soon as I step out. As soon as I step out the crib, I get that shit dirty. Gang, gang, gang in the building. This is where we at today. This is where we at today. Here in Miami. Alright, so now we about, we pulling up on Mufasa and Pumpkin right now. It's Mufasa and Pumpkin. Ah, it's Mufasa right here. Uh, so we got Mufasa, that's the eight seater. You know what I'm saying? We've been rocking, that boy been rocking with us for about, you know what I'm saying, year and a half or so. But this Pumpkin right here, this the ride or die. She been rocking with us since day one. This was, this who popped us off. You feel me? So we about to run it up. Yeah, stay tuned. Roll the roller loud. Let's get it. Yeah, you see the big three right here? Yeah, Pumpkin. Yeah, you got Pumpkin, you got Mufasa. And you got Nip right here. Yeah. Yeah. Roll the roller loud, man. You got 55 days. You got the cameraman, that boy. Ooh, that boy fishing with it. Ooh, you see that boy stance. <laughs> Look at the stance. <laughs> before 2021 because I know the pandemic happened and all that shit. My homie uh Swizz, shout out to Swizz, A.O. Swizz. It's his brother had hired me and his brother to do rides at um at Rolling Loud, right? So he rented some golf carts and had me and my dog Swizz doing rides. So we was doing five dollar rides. 
as we was doing it, I was like, hey man, this we making a lot of money out here, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's a lot of money out here. So after we did that, I was like, next rolling loud. I'm renting a golf cart and I'm doing this shit by myself. I ain't doing it for nobody else. A shout out to, you know, Swiss brother Midas. Midas Cuts, follow that boy, man. That, the hottest barber out here, man. You know what I'm saying? He really, he really uh, planted that seed, for real, for real. So yeah, so 2021, Rolling Loud came. So I ended up renting a golf cart. And so, man, I call every goddamn golf cart place in South Florida. And it was only one place that had golf carts for rent. Everybody else was talking about, oh, you gotta be a commercial, you can't do a personal, all this extra goofy shit, right? But this one place, shout out to, I think, Phoenix Golf Carts. I think that's who it was, Phoenix Golf Carts. In a uh, lot of them. So they let me rent a four seater, right? So this is an eight seater right here. This Mufasa, this is an eight seater. It could fit eight people. So they let me rent a four seater for two hundred and fifty dollars for the whole week, right? So I was like, hell yeah, this is exactly what a nigga looking for. I wish it was bigger, but fuck it. Gotta get it how you live. So. Rolling Loud came, so I got a Bluetooth speaker, and I had a four-seater, right? The first day out there, Rolling Loud. Rolling Loud is a three-day event. First day out there, doing five-dollar rides, I made $1,300, right? $1,300 my first day with a four-seater and a fucking Bluetooth speaker. So I'm like, oh yeah. So once I did that, my, my dog, Slash business partner right now seeing that and trust me I've been telling everybody about this shit. I told literally everybody about this shit, but I told this nigga he seen how much I made that day and he instantly went on the search for a golf cart. Right? So he ended up finding a golf cart and I think he paid something crazy like seven hundred dollars a day to rent that motherfucker. Right? Second day rolling loud. I had the four seater and that shit broke on me, right? At, at night, the fucking axle did some shit and it did some crazy shit and it got stuck in the middle of the road. Had to get that bitch towed. I still end up making the same thing, 1300 that day before it even broke down, right? So my dog with his golf cart, that nigga made about 2000 in that day, right? With the golf cart he rented. Now he spent about six, 700 for the day, but he made two bands. So the next day, which was the last day, I forgot how much he made again, but we ended up selling shit too, right? We were selling uh, chargers, we were selling lighters, raw papers, um, power banks. We had a whole table set up. Like we set up shop out there selling every goddamn thing. And we made some money off that too. Fans. So all in all, that whole weekend, we ended up making $8,000. All collectively, me and him, everything we sold, $8,000, right? So we was like, fuck it, we gotta keep this shit going, it's too much bread. We took that $8,000 and bought the cart that we have today known as Pumpkin, right? Bought Pumpkin, and then after we bought Pumpkin, the rest is history. Now we here. About a year and a half, almost two years later, three golf carts working on, well, we actually got four, but three is functioning right now. One we building up, and we got another one that we, we building up right now to get. We need about ten to $15,000. That's what we working on right now. So the first year we made 8,000. Then the second uh, year of Rolling Loud, right, which was last year, we made 20,000, now that's gross. That's gross, now. We had a lot of expenses and a lot of fuck shit. That's a whole nother story for the whole nother day. But we grossed 20,000, which is great. Stay tuned, man, you're on our journey. We take y'all on the journey. We were supposed to been do this shit, but we be working so goddamn much, we ain't got time to be holding cameras and shit, but I guess we do, huh? We just gotta do it. But all right, man, I'm about to tap back in, man. I gotta get back to work, man. 
That boy look tired. Yeah. That boy look tired. And we're done. And we're done. It's a wrap. It's a motherfucking wrap. Yeah, man. Now we need that back in. Sure. <laughs> yeah, so we wrapping this shit up. Right now it's 12-28. It's May 28th. Sunday, May 28th. Road to Rolling Loud, man. Just collected some coins. So now we gotta put them coins to the side so we can get this big ass nigga from Texas. I'm tired as fuck. Another contract down. This is actually our first contract we ever had with uh, all three golf carts, so it's a first for us. All right, man, holla at your boys.